Hey, welcome to the shop. Today I'm going to fix a scratched plastic motorcycle windshield. I call it plastic, but it's likely a polycarbonate like Lexan or acrylic. In any case, it's very easy to fix these with an automotive buffer and a compound that you can buy. You can see the windshield on this CBR125 is scratched pretty badly. I bought this bike to flip it, so I want to get the most value out of it that I can. So obviously you want to fix small things like this that take away from the value. So let me just take the windshield off this CBR and then I'll show you how I fixed it. To do this, I'm going to use this Novus plastic repair kit. I bought this to fix up the windshield on my 2008 Honda Goldwing, which was in really bad shape. And it worked quite well for me, so I'm confident it can work for this as well. It comes in three stages. Number one is really just a cleaner. Number two is what they call a fine scratch remover. And number three, of course, is a heavy scratch remover. So I'll start by giving it a good clean here, which you must do, because you need to get all the dirt off of something before you start polishing it certainly don't want to polish all that dirt into the surface of the plastic. Once we have it clean, I'll start with the heavy scratch remover. I just put a little bit on a paper towel or a rag and then wipe it onto the surface and then just begin buffing. And I'll just continue to buff until it looks like the compound is more or less gone. And then I'll stop and I'll put some more on and do it again. Periodically, I would just clean the surface just to see how the scratch is coming along. But it takes several applications, I would say likely four, of the heavy scratch remover compound in this case to get the scratch more or less taken down. And that's something I want to talk about when it comes to sanding and polishing anything. The most important thing to remember about doing that is the first stage you're using is the one where you remove all the damage from the surface you're trying to repair. If you were sanding, this would be the coarsest sandpaper grit that removes the worst of the damage. And then after that, you use finer grit sandpapers to remove the damage created by the first grit. And the same would apply to polishing with a compound like this. You start with the heavy scratch remover. The next one is really just to remove the scratches made by the first. So that's what I'm doing here. And once I'm finished with the heavy scratch remover and I can give it a good clean, I'll decide is the scratch far enough gone that I am happy with it because you can't take it out with the next compound. And after about four applications, I found this scratch was removed as much as I can reasonably get out of it. It's not completely gone, but it's also not gonna be very noticeable. So then I'll move on to the fine scratch remover. Again, I'll buff three or four times with that. After that, it's pretty much finished. You give it a good clean, but you can see that that scratch, which was really quite noticeable before, is all but gone now. And it's really as simple as that. Now this Novus kit, I have used it, like I said, for my Goldwing windshield. I've done one other windshield since. I probably got about half the uh, compounds left, so still quite a few more jobs that I can do. And I see this as just another tool in the arsenal of someone who's flipping motorcycles. You've got to find ways to fix those things that take away from the value of the bike. And of course, this is one of them. So I hope you found this helpful. And feel free to check around to see some of my other quick fix videos here on the channel. And thanks for watching.